Okay, good afternoon, everyone. My name is Bill Levinson, managing partner with Levinson and Associates. With me today, we have the Joseph Lochran, our marketing vice president, and we have our main agency automator developer, Kevin, is joining us as well. And by the way, he will also be live at our annual agent expo uh, on May 10th. So you'll hear him uh, present. Uh, we will present together, and he'll be available the rest of the day for uh, questions, uh, comments, if you want to pick his brain a little bit, um, also at the dinner the night before. So um, he will be available. And what we can do, in fact, uh, just let us know ahead of time. We can always try to set up a one-on-one -on -one so you can uh, introduce yourself. Okay, he's going to jump on in about uh, five to seven minutes here. So I want to jump right into today's webinar. What we're talking about is the infamous agency automator turnkey marketing platform only offered by us, Levinson and Associates. And, you know, what we've done, we launched this, it's been uh, almost a couple years now, but what we've done, and, and we try to do this every year, is, is make things bigger and, and better uh, for our agents out there. You know, and it, it's so important that you are using some type of marketing platform. OK, I don't care if it's, uh, you know, Salesforce or maybe a, a custom CRM tool, whatever it is, that's fine. OK, but we wanted to develop our own and it's the first and only life insurance geared CRM and marketing platform. It's never been done before. And then the second challenge, what we wanted to do was offer this at no charge. OK. So there's a, a, a few different levels here, and this is what we're going to jump into today, but I wanted to first clarify so we have a clear understanding. The way that this works, if you're an active Levinson agent, okay, so as long as you're licensed with us, with at least one carrier, hopefully more, but at least one carrier, you get the free, complete retail website, Okay, which includes, we have various insurance calculators, we have client videos, we have a full life insurance quoting engine with built-in lead capture. Okay, all included for free. You can customize this, you can pick whatever template picture you want or customize the About Us picture with you and the family and the dog. Anything you want to do, yes, it's 100% free. There's no gray area or small print. Okay, you also get a free CRM tool. Okay, this is a, a basic CRM. Now, this includes up to 100 of your contacts. Okay, now if you have a thousand or ten thousand, are you? Yes, we do have co op packages that are available, but the bottom line is you get the free website builder, the free CRM version, okay, up to a hundred of your contacts, and then everything that's built in to the website builder. There's a bunch of legs coming out, everything is customizable, and it's a hundred percent free. There's a hosting charge of $9.95 a month, okay? That is it. There's no activation. There's no yearly increases. There's no contracts that you have to sign. There's no small print. So you know the value of that. If you're looking at, you know, purchasing a life insurance website with quote engines and lead capture and CRM, you're spending hundreds and hundreds a month and at least a couple grand up front. So lots of value here. And Kevin's going to talk about the various packages that go on above and beyond the basic free version. We're also launching the 100% autopilot. Okay, so what we're going to talk about, Kevin's going to dive in, I don't want to steal his thunder, but we're, we launched a new version for 2019 where you can literally sit back, focus on your day-to-day -day selling and have someone in the background doing all of the work for you, having like a, a point person to depend on for all of your marketing, okay? These are all co-op packages where we chip in and then obviously you'll pay the balance, okay, if you want to get one of these deluxe packages, but it's so inexpensive. If you look at this compared to anything else that's available out there, or if you just say, hey, Bill, I want to start with the basic CRM and the website, it doesn't cost you a penny. 
Okay, so there's lots and lots of value add. If you have any agents in your downline or anybody that you're looking at possibly recruiting and bringing over, this is a great value add to talk about because no one else has this. Even if the agent says, oh, Bill, I work with ABC Financial and I've been with them for 22 years and we have a great relationship. Well, that's wonderful, okay? But what are they giving you to help you market yourself and make more sales, right? Do they have any free sales platforms? And the answer is usually no. So there's lots of value here in Sizzle, and you can use all of this to build your downline. So uh, lots of great ideas here. Just jot down notes, questions, comments, anything that you want us to dive into further. If you want to uh, chat, and there's a uh, bottom right box there, uh, bottom right corner, you can type in questions uh, as we go. Joe's going to do his best to get all of these answered. If we don't answer right away, we'll answer after the webinar is over. Okay, one more thing I'm going to talk about before we jump in real quick. As we're, we're going through the slides, you know, think about in your mind, and I spoke about this yesterday on our webinar, it, it's so important, okay, and, and I, I say this all the time, don't listen to what we have to say. You don't have to listen to me and Kevin and Joe. Watch what we do. Watch our actions, okay? Check out our e-blast marketing. Look at our email blasting. Look at these live training webinars. Look at our videos that we make. Look at our social media pages, okay? Almost every day we're constantly dripping and branding and getting our message across. In fact, we all have these smartphones in our hands, right? I don't care if it's an Apple phone or if it's Google Android powered, it doesn't matter. That device in your hand that everybody is on, by the way, these days, I don't care if you're 82 or 17, okay? Let's face it, our cell phones are literally glued to our heads, okay? The bottom line is everyone's on these. You always have this in your pocket. If you see something cool, if you're with a client and they say, you know, Bill, your service is awesome, Okay, what I do is I say, whoa, 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 hold on, hold on. I take out my phone and I say, say that one more time. And if you don't mind, I'm going to record this. And then I look at everything. If I get a good picture or I get a good testimonial or I have a great idea about Index UL and retirement savings, whatever the case is, I always think to myself, I'm going to take out my device, record or take a picture. And then there's a four leg approach. Okay, I take that material right away and I think four legs number one get it out on my website number two get it out on all of my social media pages number three I'm going to e-blast it I want this to get out to all of my prospects and clients instantly number four is I'll make a quick video with my cell phone it doesn't have to be professionally edited make a one-minute video on why IUL is so great for young professionals and retirement use one of our great sales ideas okay it's free to post it on YouTube then post it on your website then post it on your social media pages so think four leg approach okay whatever the idea is whatever the picture is four legs number one website social media e-blast video done move on to the next sale or idea whatever you have going on but if you get in that habit and routine all the time slowly but surely you're going to plant the seed and when your clients and prospects think of insurance or annuities or investment products they're going to remember you i promise you okay it's just clever branding with the internet now there's no stopping you. I don't care what degree you have or don't have or when you dropped out of school or how far you made it through Yale or Princeton. It doesn't matter anymore. We're all starting from the same place with the Internet now. Okay, so, so important. Okay, let's move forward here. I know I'm getting a little long-winded. Okay, moving forward, talk about innovation, right? You, you heard about uh, Sears and, and, and Kmart filing for bankruptcy. I think it was Monday or Tuesday. Okay, we all want to innovate. We want to be the new Ubers and Amazon. We don't want to be a, a Yellow Cab or Kmart or Sears. So you have to think of new ways to get your message out. And this is our new way, okay? Launching the first quarter of 19, that's Bill Levinson, 
podcast. We're calling it the Bill Levinson Experience. So at least once a month, we're gonna have a different featured speaker and they're gonna be talking about business in general, motivation, technology, and then the insurance brokerage industry. So this is going to be awesome. It's available in your app store, in your, on your podcast channel, on your cell phones, or through YouTube, or we're gonna have a section on our website if you can't find it. So once a month, we're gonna host these live, and then of course they'll be recorded, but this is going to be huge. You can listen to this in your car on the way to an appointment. Uh, the first guest speaker is Jeff Levitet's top Forbes 500 businessman, Cleveland Clinic just named him their man of the year. Uh, he's my mentor for 22 years. The first one is going to be awesome. And hopefully that will set the stage for the rest of the podcast. So great stuff to come. And I hope that, you know, you're again, you're watching our actions and not just listening. We're constantly coming out with something new to help plant the seed and brand. You want to do the same thing as us, but on a retail level. Okay, so real quick, moving forward, what's new in 19 for Levinson? Talk about innovation, pushing the envelope, moving forward. Our Sell While You Sleep platform is going to be the Amazon for insurance products. We already have 10 different insurance products on the platform, and you can use your free website builder to post your link. And the whole point is you want to drive traffic to your Sell While You Sleep platform, and your client can look at disability, critical illness, life insurance. They can line up all the products, look at a side-by-side -side comparison, and then just click on whichever product they want to apply for. You get full commission plus renewals, and you don't do anything, okay? 100% client-driven. That's launching quarter one of 2019. The new Levinson Senior Division is also launching in the first quarter of 19. Folks, we have brought on, we hired, in my opinion, the best guy from a huge health insurance company that's in Florida. I can't mention any names, but he is starting in the first quarter of 2019. We're going to have all of Medicare Sub, Med Advantage, standalone health plans. We have an awesome exclusive lead program, okay, that's tied to MedSup. That's going to be awesome, big game changer. So the Levinson Senior Division in-house is launching quarter one, 19. Also our Life Settlement Division. We now have an online quoter. So if you have a case, okay, and they fall into our parameters, at least 65, and you want to get a ballpark offer for your client to see if it's worth settling, let us know. We can make sure that you have the offer and hopefully it all pans out and your client can walk away with a nice settlement and you with a nice commission. Okay, moving forward here, I'm just about done and then we're going to introduce the feature presenter of today. Real quick, top tools platforms to grow your business, okay? We know if we don't go out there and constantly innovate and come out with new stuff for our agents to help get their message across, then we are falling behind, okay? And it's that simple. And I hope you look at your business the same way. Now, marketing-wise, complete turnkey CRM prospecting platform, you get a 1,000 leads monthly, okay? You can literally dive into our system and type in, I want uh, everyone turning age 65 in this zip code uh, that have grandkids, you know, whatever the case is, and the system will spit out a 1,000 names, numbers, emails, addresses when available, okay? Uh, and, and then you can obviously set up your marketing campaign, and you can even have your VIP host reach out to every single contact that comes up for you and turn those into leads, okay? That's a game changer. Product services, our Sell While You Sleep platform is a game changer, never been done before in our industry. This is direct to consumer, okay, from the agent, from you to go after prospects and drive traffic to your website to make these sales. Process and technology, exclusive access to custom drop tickets, e-delivery, e-requirement, consumer website, electronic, everything. This is going to make your life easier. We're not trying to complicate things, but it's very important that you know what's available to help simplify and streamline your business. Okay, just remember, seven, eight, ten years ago, 
there were not e-applications in our business. We used to sit there on boards and, and on panels trying to tell the carriers, look what other industries are doing. Why are we not doing this today? Okay? Fast forward, we now have carriers that say to themselves, if we don't have an e-application, we basically should be out of business. So look how things have changed in such a short time. And we have a lot of those proprietary electronic app platforms because of that. But you also need to have the same forward type of thinking. The bottom, industry-leading training, that's what you're on right now. At least once a week, we hop on these live webinar trainings, and we try to simplify your life with these. So, I mean, if, if you want to just kind of catch up or see what's going on, what's hot, what's new, what you can use to change your year, you can jump on our Kerry Levinson website. We have a training calendar. All of our webinars are listed, okay? You can register right from there and see what's coming up for that week, okay? And what we're also gonna do is send out a thank you email to everybody on today's call with all of this information at your fingertips. All right, agency automator updates. Now, again, I don't wanna steal Kevin's uh, thunder, but, um, I'm just going to talk about a, a few things because <laughs> I get a little carried away here. Updates. Uh, we have a new button on your retail website, okay, for the scholarship section. So, you know, we just had literally an agent walk in probably 15, 20 minutes ago. He came in wearing a nice suit and he had a polo shirt under a suit jacket that had his logo on it. And on his suit jacket, he had the scholarship pin. It says, ask me about free scholarships, okay? He wears that pin everywhere. He does it look a little, uh, eh, not so professional, whatever. You can call it whatever you want. It opens doors because people ask the question. This guy wears it to the grocery store. He's probably laughing right now on this call driving home, but he wears it to the grocery store, his kids' sports games, whatever it is, because why? It opens doors. So you can talk about life insurance that comes with a one-year scholarship for Johnny or Susie. So what we did is we added a built-in section on your website because the whole point you're driving traffic to your online website, so you want people to hit the ask question button or set meeting button, which obviously will get you a new appointment over the phone or in person so you can make the sale. We also have this brand new VIP package. Okay, this is where you can focus on your day-to-day -day sales. You say, Bill, I don't have time to go on social media. I don't care about Facebook, and I don't want to put together an e-blast. No problem. We have a full team available that's going to do all of your marketing for you. Kevin's going to talk more about that. We're also coming up with mobile optimization for your website. So basically that means that anybody with a smartphone can pull up your website and it will reformat itself to fit inside of that small screen that I think that's going to be done next week. So Kevin can talk more about that. Without further ado, I want to introduce uh, my good friend and our programmer that we've been working for, uh, it's probably been a few years now. Uh, great, great guy. He's literally helping us take the business platform to the next level. And that's what he's going to do today. Kevin, you there? I'm here. Thank you, Kev. All right, Bill. Thanks a lot. Thanks, Joe. And uh, welcome, everyone. Um, I probably at some point have uh, met many of you on one of our live demos. So welcome to our training today. We're going to do a little something different. As Bill talked about, we're going to talk about 2019 enhancements for Agency Automator. Some things that we've already done and are in the program that you may not be aware of, and then some things that we're working on, like Bill mentioned, uh, the mobile aspect of it. And this diagram uh, that you're looking at right now pretty much describes, you know, what's going on in the in the online world. There's a lot of stuff going on between, you know, Twitter and Facebook and email and and uh, all kinds of different things. The cloud, maybe a lot of you don't even know what the cloud is. I didn't know what it was uh, at first either. It took a little explanation. But there's so much going on and it could be very confusing for for you know, people that of, of every age. So, you know, if you're an older person and, and you get a little frustrated about, you know, online um, marketing or anything online, anything having to do with the computer, then I don't blame you because there's a lot of a lot of stuff out there that, that's, that can be confusing. 
So what we're trying to do with agency automator is try to make it a lot less confusing. You know, it's never going to be 100%, you know, uh, turnkey in the sense that, you know, you just kind of push a button and everything just happens for you. Uh, you do have to put some time and effort into it, but we're trying to take a lot of the complexity out of marketing your business online. So what we're going to talk about today is we're going to talk first about Agency Automator. And for those of you that may be new to Levinson or new to the Agency Automator product, we'll just give you a quick little recap of what's in the product. Then we'll talk about some new things that are coming. And then after that, we're actually going to do a little email 101. So it's a little basic you know, training, a little uh, best practice type uh, training on that on just email in general, because a lot of you may be new to email marketing, or maybe you've tried it in the past, and maybe you've failed with it, or you, you've gotten blocked or blacklisted or something like that. And we want you to come back to it if that's ever happened to you, because we've really tried to address all of those concerns, issues, and risks you know, through the agency automator system. So take a lot of the complexity out of it and just make it you know, a, a much more user-friendly uh, tool to work with. So Agency Automator, it is unique, as Bill's talked about. There is nothing like it that exists in the marketplace. And what uh, Levinson has brought to the table here is just phenomenal. I mean, from the pricing standpoint, from a, from a content standpoint, from a marketing standpoint, they've added so much value to what is, you know, a software program. So it's software, but the art part of it, the, the artistic part of it is what Levinson has really uh, turned Agency Automator into you know, a, a tool that, that goes well beyond just, just software. So first thing we, we want to talk about is, uh, as uh, uh, Bill mentioned earlier, the website. So there is a website program inside of Agency Automator. It is a, uh, it's tied to your user profile. So once again, in the effort to try to make this as easy for you as possible, because some website programs, maybe you've gone out and tried Wix or you tried the GoDaddy, program there's there's some complexity to that you got to drop and drag things all over the place and, and it could be a little frustrating so we're what we've done is we've kind of simplified it and we made it uh, more targeted for for the insurance agent and, and we tied everything into your user profile so if you do a good job of loading information into your user profile photos logos personal profile business profile social icons etc then with a couple of clicks, you're going to be able to add that information into your agency automated website. So we're real excited about that. And this is an ongoing work in progress. So, you know, as Bill mentioned, we're in the process of taking the, the website and making it more mobile friendly. It is mobile friendly right now, but sometimes it can be a little bit challenging depending on the device and how many menu items that, that you've selected, you know, for your website. So we're going to make that a lot, lot more, um, easier to, uh, for everybody to, to, to look at and to navigate. There is a CRM built into the program. You know, there's a lot of different CRMs out there. So ours is clearly a marketing CRM that has a lot of insurance capabilities built into it. So if you want to add in your policy information, you want to add in tasks, you want to add notes, you want to put in, uh, you know, even wedding anniversaries and so on, birth dates, you can put that into the, into the CRM. Once you add somebody into the CRM, and we do only allow you to add clients into the CRM. So, so CRM in our vocabulary equals clients, just so you're clear, because we'll be talking about different aspects of it. You could send them as many emails as you like. And we've got a lot of other tools that, that we've built into the CRM. You could, you could store files, like I said, notes and reminders, and you actually get a daily email reminder for every reminder that you set, you know, like it's a birth date or a wedding anniversary or or policy renewal is important to you and you want to set up a reminder, then you can turn on the reminder reminder function for that particular event and you'll get a daily email from us. Uh, you can prospect for new clients. And this is something that makes our program totally unique. No one else is going to allow you to do this. These are uh, a prospect equals non-client. So try to go to contact or try to go to um, constant contact or MailChimp after you bought some list on the internet and try to send an email campaign to it. Maybe you can get the first one out, but then by the time you get a lot of bounces, you get a lot of complaints, and that's probably what's gonna happen when you send emails to prospects, then they're gonna kick you off the system. So we don't do that. So our prospecting program makes our program completely unique from any other email system that, that's out there. 
Also, what makes it even further unique is that we have a database for you to choose from. So you don't have to go buy a database. There's 28 million consumers in our database and almost 7 million businesses. You have a search engine that allows you to go in to drill down by location, by birth date. So if you're looking for people that are turning age 65 next month or the next three months or six months, go into the consumer database and you can, you can build a list uh, for location, birth date, net worth, income, tobacco users, even the way that they vote. There's all kinds of different criteria in there that you can search from uh, in order to build the right kind of profile that's a good fit for whatever you're marketing. The business side, you could search by uh, industry code, titles, how many employees they have. So if you're targeting businesses, and we recommend this, and if you've ever been on one of my uh, prospect uh, live demo trainings, I tell people all the time, don't forget about businesses. You know, these are mostly small businesses that are in our database, and these, are, these people need your services just as much as any individual consumer. Agent recruiting, we added in agent recruiting kind of late last year into the program. So now you have a complete platform. We used to have it in two separate platforms, Agency Automator Plus, Agency Automator. Now it's all Agency Automator, it's all incorporated. So what that means is that it saves you a lot of money. You know, so by doing that, because you can buy credits from, because you need credits in order to send out prospecting emails inside of our system. So one credit equals one email that you're gonna send. And that bank of credits that you buy can be used to send a consumer email, a business email, or an agent recruiting email. So we've got 400,000 agents in our database. So if you're trying to build a downline, and Levinson has got one of the best you know, uh, recruiting programs I've ever seen. So agents that wanna build additional income, wanna build their downline, build their, their franchise, you know, Levinson is absolutely the best place to do that. Custom email templates and newsletters. We've got six different newsletters that we update every three months. And if you're not sending newsletters to your clients, especially to your clients right now, you're really missing out because you got to be thinking about, you know, how many, touch, how many touches do I have with my clients throughout the course of the year? And a lot of times, you know, you sell them, you kind of move on to the next thing. You want to be dripping on your clients because you want to stay top of mind and you want to stay present in their inbox. And newsletters is a great way to do that. Same thing with automated birth date and holiday emails that we have as well. So we call that set it and forget it. Birthdays, holidays, business review dates, you know, if you're going to meet with people on a regular basis to review their, their business, these are all key touch points and key events for the client that you can continue to drip on so that they, they remember, oh yeah, I remember that guy. I bought a life insurance policy or Medicare SUP or DI from, from them. So they're going to think about you the next time as well. Everything's trackable and reportable. And that's the thing that really makes email different than any other online marketing media is that, you know, if you can, you can go out and buy a Google click uh, campaign and Google's going to charge you every time somebody goes out and, and clicks over, but they're never going to tell you who did the clicking. Inside of email, we do. We, we give you the name, the email address, the phone number, if we have one, all the contact information so that you can take, make that decision to follow up with that person. Everything's also can spam compliant. If you're not familiar with the law in our country that regulates the sending of commercial and marketing emails, you need to get familiar with it. And we have a little link down at the bottom of our account. So if you look down in the footer of your agency automator account, it says can spam. Make sure that you get familiar with that. We talk about it on all the trainings as well. You need to make sure that you're in compliance with the law and our system helps you to do that. But it, but it really relies on you. The virtual assistant, we're really excited about the virtual assistant and we're taking that up another notch in, in 2019. So the virtual assistant, we've got some people, some agents have tried it, some agents have come in and, and used it. And the virtual assistant takes a lot of the, you know, a lot of the administrative work and building lists, sending out campaigns, and then even the follow-up. Uh, the follow-up is really a critical piece. So the, you don't have time to call your openers and your clickers, you know, and those are the people that actually engaged with your message, you know, that actually paid attention, then the virtual assistant can do that. Now, some new things. Uh, along those lines with the virtual assistant, we now have just rolled out a VIP plan, very important person, you know, so you are very important to us. 
And what the VIP plan does is it does all the onboarding stuff for you as well as the ongoing virtual assistant. So we've, we've uh, given you a bigger plan. You get more sending credits, you get more CRM space, you get a, uh, actually a little cheaper uh, virtual assistant plan. So it's a little cheaper than the normal $10 uh, per hour that's built into the VA plan. So you get a full package of everything that, that you need. We even do a VIP orientation call with you. So, you know, we do, it, it's, when you buy the, the basic plan, we, we, incur, we want you to come to our trainings. We want you to use the, the videos. You can always call us if you have a question or if you have a technical problem, but we can't spend, you know, an hour with you on the phone. It's just, it's just not practical. We can't do that. But if you're a VIP user, we spend whatever time you need in order to get you up and running and make sure that, that you're moving in the right direction to be successful with the plan. So check it out. It's more expensive because you pay for what you get. But the VIP plan, we think, is, is going to have some real legs and it's going to help a lot of people in, in their situation. Not right for everybody, but, but perfect for some. We just added a reoccurring drip campaign. So uh, what that's all about is you can pick the the uh, message, you pick the list, and then you can pick the number of weeks that you want this thing to run. So this is, again, another low maintenance uh, offer that we've added into the program. So you want it to run for the next 20 weeks and you pick the, you know, every Tuesday, then you can build that drip campaign and then you can come back and build another one. So maybe you have a drip campaign for life insurance that goes to one list and you have another one for DI that goes to another list. So it, again, once again, we're trying to take a lot of the maintenance out of the program for you. So if you're going to run, you're going to run the program yourself. You know, we want to put, you know, we're adding more and more of these uh, kind of low maintenance uh, tools into the program. Domain blocking. This is something that uh, we haven't announced until today that if you want to block uh, domains, you know, like uh, let's say for, for some reason you don't want to send emails to Yahoo. You know, because you're not having any luck with it, or maybe there's some some issues there, you can block Yahoo. You know, so it's in the unsubscribe manager inside your account. So you can uh, normally in the unsubscribe manager, it just blocks individual email addresses. You know, John Smith at Yahoo.com gets blocked or unsubscribed. But now you can block an an entire domain using this new blocking feature. Online search advertising. This is a SureWorks. We train on this every Monday. So if you go into your agency automator account. On the um, live demo button that's on the dashboard page, you'll see that Monday is our AssureWorks training. If you've ever gone out and done a search online for, let's say, um, maybe you did a search for vacation rentals, and then you go back online and you're searching around and on different pages, and now you see all these vacation rental ads popping up. What that is, is that's because the browser has spoken to, uh, they, the browser basically has has identified that this is something that, that you're interested in, and then it pulls in advertising on different pages from different ad, ad firms or ad companies, and is trying to present to you things that they think that you're interested in. So AssureWorks does the same thing, but they do it for insurance. So there's two different parts to this. There is a zip code-based AssureWorks program. You buy a zip code. You can buy one slot, or you can buy up to a maximum three slots in a zip code and own the whole zip code. So for 59 bucks, you can buy one of those zip code slots. And then anybody that goes out doing insurance browsing, health insurance, BI, life insurance, any kind of insurance browsing, and they end up on a website like Yahoo Finance or CNN or Fox News or any of hundreds and hundreds of different websites that display ads, then your ad is going to pop up for that person that lives in that zip code. So you'll see this little agency automator ad here with this big red arrow. So that's how it's going to look like on a Yahoo Finance page. So the other program is called a database program, which is super cool, you know, but you got to have a database. So let's say you got a targeted database of CPAs or lawyers or doctors or some group that you really want to target because you, you've got a specialty type business and you really want to go after a very specific target market. Get, buy a list or come to us and we can try to get a list for you. As long as it's got an email address in it, you upload it into the database. And then anywhere that person is online doing searching and on, on any website that displays ads, 
then we're then SureWorks is going to try to display your ad in front of that person. So if that doctor is out there Googling, you know, where's the nearest Starbucks and ends up on some search page uh, that's got ads displaying on it, then your face may show up and right and be right there in front of them. So it's great for for current clients to stay in, in contact with them. It's great for prospects, great for targeted marketed or target marketing, like I just mentioned, with very specific groups. So think of it as zip code or geo targeting type of an ad display, and then database ad display where you have your own database. Really cool program, different prices for both. 5,000 ad views for the zip code program for each, each zip that you buy. Uh, $99 a month uh, for the database program, and you get 2,500 ad views. And then you get a, a really cool little tool that allows you to build the ad. You don't, have, don't need somebody to go design it for you and, and incur that expense. Build the ad inside their little, their little wizard tool, publish it, change it whenever you want, uh, and, you know, and then just turn the thing on and let it run. And then you get a daily update from SureWorks every day that shows you, just like I did, hey, your ad was on Yahoo Finance yesterday, and here's what it looked like. And, you, and by the way, you had 200 ads uh, you know, on, on the web, and you had 100 uh, views on Facebook because it works on Facebook as well, and you had another 100 on some mobile, you know, uh, mobile web ad. So it gives you an update on a daily basis of all the different activity. So really cool program. Check it out. Come to our, our Monday uh, training session to learn more about it. We've got a lot of agents really starting to, to jump on this. The price is 59 bucks for that one zip code, but it's not going to stay $59 forever because, I mean, you could go buy the zip code for downtown Manhattan, New York for 59 bucks, and it's the same $59 for some zip code out in, you know, in Nebraska somewhere and right in the middle of corn country. So it could be, you know, it could be a, um, you know, a major metropolitan area or a rural area still costs you the same amount. This is the pricing and Bill was kind of talking about. It. So this is the um, agency automator price and we got a lot of different plans. We have this $10 hosting fee that if you just want the website plan, it costs you 10 bucks. That's the hosting fee and we throw in 100 CRM contacts. So you can send unlimited emails to up to 100 CRM contacts. It doesn't do prospecting. You have to buy at least a $35 plan and you get 1,000 credits a month with that and you can upload up to 1,000 clients. And then the VIP plan, it's gonna cost you more. It's 250 bucks for the VIP plan, but you get the best plan that, that we have. We max out the, the, the uh, credits that you get every single month and they never expire. And we only take a credit if an email gets delivered too, by the way, which nobody, nobody does that. Try, try to go to some email marketing company that, uh, that allows you to send emails out using credits and ask them if you could have the credits back if an email bounces. That'll never happen. So a lot of great stuff there. And some new stuff that's coming, mobile ready, meta tags, insurance article library for, for your website, and then also the ability to send email campaigns using your own email address. So every email that goes out through our system right now comes out from a system generated email address that has your name or your company name before the at symbol and then uses one of our domains. But you may have clients that you're sending emails to that have already safe, you know, that they've already saved your email as a safe sender. So, which means they've already kind of pre-approved you, they whitelisted your email. Or, you know, maybe your, your email, all your emails are not uh, getting to everybody in, and they only recognize or will only look at the ones coming from you, from your email address, your own personal email address. So this could be a big deal for a lot of people as well, if that's the case. So we're gonna have that capability to be able to turn on here shortly. But the mobile ready part, and uh, uh, Bill, we're testing it right now. In fact, we're testing it, and I'm still hoping that by the end of next week, we'll have it uh, ready to go. Excellent, Kevin, thank you. Email Marketing 101. Okay, so let me just kind of zip through this if I can, because you know uh, I do want to do this on a more regular basis. We haven't done this before. We talk about email best practices in our uh, live demos, but we very seldom ever have enough time to really dig into the details. So we're gonna do that. We're gonna try to do that right now. Pros and cons of email marketing. There's a lot of great pros, but there are cons. Uh, that, and you need to be aware. And the whole idea behind this, this kind of 101 uh, best practice training that, that we're doing right now is that make you aware of kind of what the email 
industry, what the email um, as a marketing media uh, looks like, you know, and, and what you need to be aware of. It's low cost. You're never going to find anything that's cheaper. It's highly targeted. You could get right down to one zip code. You could get right down to one guy's, uh, you know, city uh, uh, area code, uh, zip code radius down to one mile. Uh, promote your brand. You know, you do have a brand. Even if it's just your name, you have a brand. You have offers. You're offering life. You're offering health. You're offering different products. You need to be promoting those on a regular basis, and this gives you full customization to be able to say whatever you want and pr promote whatever you want. Drives web traffic. Bill talks about this a lot. It's really critical. You have to have a website. If you don't have a website, you don't exist. You know, you don't exist in, uh, in the ether. You don't exist in the internet if you don't have a website. You have to be able to, to have a website because most people are gonna go to your website to see if you are real and if you're legit. So that's really what it's all about, what it comes down to. Uh, feed your social networking. Social networking is a, you know, is a foreign thing to a lot of people, but it doesn't need to be. Uh, as you're sending out emails, you're, you're gonna be promoting your social network uh, links and pages, and then you're gonna try to drive traffic to those people. And when you have a social networking connection, that's an opt-in connection. Trackable and exportable. That's what we were talking about, the difference between Google Ads and email. You can track it and you get reports. Now the cons part of it is, it doesn't always produce immediate results. Can't tell you how many conversations I've had with agents that say, oh, yeah, I send out an email and I didn't get any phone calls. So, well, maybe you need to send a few more. Maybe you need to keep doing it and, and do it on a regular basis and be committed to it. I've never seen any, uh, in my experience, I've never seen any marketing program that produces Im immediate results. Maybe there's something out there, but most, most of the time, it's not. You have to stick with it. It is a numbers game too. So you need to, on the email, in the email world, you need to send out as many as you can because everybody gets a lot of emails and not all your emails are going to get looked at. Not all, not all of them are going to get delivered. The inbox saturation part of it is really what I'm talking about. We all get a lot of emails. It doesn't mean that, that you can't have success with it, but you just have to understand the fact that we all get a lot of emails. I can't tell you how many times I've talked to somebody that says, I've been sending the same thing with, to the same list for 10 weeks or 10 months. And now I finally got somebody that, that you know, replied and responded or filled out my form. That's because most likely that prospect that you sent to, that 10th time was the first time that they noticed it. The other times they didn't even pay attention because life goes on. You know, they didn't even notice it. Delivery challenge. There's, you know, maybe you've had problems in, in your past about getting emails delivered, just your inbox, you know, your Outlook maybe, or your Gmail delivered. Delivery is, uh, challenges are just, uh, you know, the, a fact of life. Even you send email, if you send emails to your clients, you, you may not get them all delivered. And you certainly would not get them all opened or looked at. The national open rate for emails that you send to clients right now is 20%. So 80% of your emails that you send to people that know you and like you are not even getting looked at. So that's just, that's just the reality. So that's why you gotta be in it for the long term. Okay, let me get back here. Okay, now this is the minefield that I live in every day. So when you send out an email, it goes to a gateway. A gateway, call it Gmail, right? It goes to a server. Then after Gmail looks at it, sniffs around a little bit, says, ah, this is okay, passes it through to your inbox. Now your inbox has got a virus software spam filter. You got a, maybe you use Outlook and you got your own spam filter inside of Outlook to set it high, medium, low, turn it on, turn it off, whatever. Block this domain, approve this domain. So there's people nowadays have so many options just in their inbox on, on the ways that they can block emails that, that maybe they don't like, or maybe they're a little suspicious, or they can let them in. So it's not just the server anymore. It's the server uh, at Gateway plus the spam, the spam filters that, that we got to deal with. So that's why when you send out an agency automator prospecting email that's got a lot of information in it, like buy life insurance and things like that, you know, it looks good to you, looks enticing to you, but it may not look that good to some spam filter where a guy has set it up pretty high because he wants to block a lot of that stuff. So that's why you may get a 20% uh, 
delivery rate or 30% or 40% delivery rate because of all that filtering that goes on. In our world, on the CRM side, your delivery rate's gonna be on average between 30 to 70%, sometimes more, sometimes less. Depends on, a, lot of, a lot of it depends on content and our ability to kind of get around a lot of the filters. And we try everything that we can. Your open rate, maybe nobody opens it. Maybe you get that 20% average that I was talking about. Click rate, you know, which is based on the opens. So if somebody looks at it and says, ah, this looks pretty interesting. I want to go visit that site or watch that video or sign up for that, you know, registration. Maybe up to 5%, maybe more, maybe less. So it's not going to be perfect. And then on the delivery side for non-clients, it's less. Maybe 10% to 50% delivery rate. And keep in mind, we only charge you a credit for the ones that get delivered. And that's, that's unique in the industry. So I'll just bring you back to that. So we're not, you're not getting penalized for the ones that, that don't get delivered. Open rate, again, maybe nobody opens it. Maybe you get a decent open rate. Click rate, same thing. So what it comes down to is somebody gets an email in their inbox. You know, it gets through all the filters. We got through that whole minefield. And there it is. And it comes from you or your company name. And the guy's scratching his head because he doesn't know you. And then he looks over at your subject line and goes, ah, okay, well, maybe that's a little interesting. I'll check that out. Subject lines, as we'll talk about in a moment with content development, content is king. And subject line is the king of kings. So you need to always have a good subject line. Have a game plan. Target your prospects. Target local. Do not be blasting emails all around the country. You know, you're in Topeka, Kansas, sending an email to somebody in New York City, and, you know, there it is with your face, and it says Topeka, Kansas, and, and how great your low-cost term insurance is. And that guy in New York goes, ah, what? Yeah, but I don't want anything to do with this. So, you know, uh, but now if, he's, if you're local, now you at least got a shot. It's like, oh, okay, he's in my backyard. Maybe I know him. Maybe we work together. You know, maybe we play, you know, his kids are on the same ball team as, as me. You need to leverage that local aspect, you know, in order to get some kind of trust leverage, you know, with, with your uh, message to a non-client. Build your email to, to fit in that, uh, it, from a design standpoint, in that uh, window pane. So most people look at emails now in their inbox in a very small little window pane. So they're looking at the very top part of your email. Make sure that your main benefit statement is up at the top of your email. Test your email and then friend check it, you know, friend test it. Send it to this friend, send it to that friend, say, hey, what do you think? You know, first of all, does it look all right? First of all, is this something that you would be interested in? You know, so get a good uh, group of friends, you know, colleagues and friend test the, the heck out of that email. Select the right time. So if you're gonna send B2B, you know, like if you're sending to a business, then Tuesday through Thursday is great. B2C, you know, business to client, Thursday through Sunday even, you know, cause a lot of people get caught up with their personal emails. If they don't have time, if they're too busy during the week, they might get caught up towards the weekend or over the weekend. Follow up on your opens and clicks. These are leads. If I could have, if I should have put that in red, you know, these are your leads because everybody, well, where's the leads? Send out your emails, and if somebody pays attention to it and they open or they click, that's a big deal. So it may not, you may not be thinking about that, it, thinking about it that way, but an open is a big deal. A click is a huge deal because we all get too many emails and a lot of them get ignored and deleted. So if somebody's going to spend three seconds to look at your email and then another whatever amount of time to click and even investigate further, that's a big deal. That is a suspect lead. So check that out, follow up on it. Be realistic. We've been talking about that all the way along. You're not going to get all your emails delivered. You're not going to get them all open. You're not going to get them all clicked. But you know what? You're going to get some. And I tell people all the time, send out that prospect an email and, hey, I only got 10 opens or I only got two clicks. I said, well, that's 10 more opens than you had an hour ago, and that's two more clicks than you had an hour ago. That's progress. That's the way you have to measure things inside uh, with e with email and with marketing in general. So you you have to be realistic and say that's a that's a a good thing. Take those people, those ten opens, those ten clicks, move them to the CRM because we do allow you to do that. You can even do it automatically. 
And then once they're in the CRM, you can send them emails to the cows come home. There's no credits required. And they'll get your birth date emails. If there's a birth date in the record, they'll get your holiday emails. You can send them newsletters. So they've taken a step in your direction. You, and so you need to look at that as a positive. And then be persistent. You know, the, the persistency, I don't have to tell you guys, if you've been in the business for a while, you've had a lot of setbacks, I'm sure. You've had a lot of people said no, but you're still here. You're still out there cranking every single day. You're still shaking those bushes. You're still throwing that net out, you know, to catch those fish. That's the way you need to be here because it's not going to work if you don't. And then use that recurring drip campaign that we talked about that to really take some of the maintenance out of it. Just to put that, just turn that faucet on drip, 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 and let that sucker work. Email content. This is a critical piece. This is something really we haven't talked a lot about. People ask me, well, what's, you know, what's, what do I do? What do I send? You know, it's like, I don't don't ask me what, what, this is your business. You need to, you need to know what works. I don't need, I don't know what works for you. You need to know what works. So you, let's say you've been in business for five years, 10 years, 20 years, 30 years, you've made some sales or you wouldn't be in business. So something is working for you. Stick with what works for you. Not what works for the other guy, but what works for you. Cause nobody tells that story as good as you do. Nobody tells that story about life insurance or DI or, or retirement planning or whatever you're, whatever it is that, that you've been marketing all these years. That's the basis for your email messages, everything that's worked for you. I'm, what I'm trying to do is get you to narrow it down to at least the top, you know, one, two, three most successful offers, most successful success stories. That's what sells. Focus on what, what works for you because you're going to be able to, you know that better than anybody. And you know that, that you know how to market that and you know how to tell that story better than everybody. And then if you've been telling it to just a little audience, you know, so now you're having a little, you know, you've been having some success, you know, sell a life policy, a DI or whatever, you know, from time to time. And you're, you're making, you know, you're making okay money, but, but your, your pool is, is like, you know, small. Broaden your pool. Make your pool into a lake, into an ocean. Tell that same story that you know so well, that success that you've had and that you've, that's kept you in business and made you prosper, and tell it to more people. That's how you become successful. Take what works, what sells, and tell it to a bigger audience. And never stop telling that story. And this all becomes the basis for your marketing content with your email. So, well, I, you know, if you do, need some help translating, and that's really what you're doing, you're translating something that you do naturally when you meet with somebody in a conversation, you got to translate that into a document, into an email with imagery and with text. We can lend some help to that. Email design. This is all about what we were talking about. Think hard about what you're offering. Is this something that, that you or one of your friends or one of your colleagues would have been interested in? If it's not, then don't do it. Keep it brief and impactful. On the road, you see a billboard for something. It catches your eye. It's got to be very brief. It's got to it's got to get to the point very quickly, a billboard, if it's going to be successful. That's the way you need to look at an email. It's not your life story. You know, it's not a novel. It's got to be really short and sweet because people are only going to burn a few brain cells you know spending some time looking at your emails and they got to get to the point and then you got to get them on to the next step which is click on this read this call this you know watch this and that's really what it's all about let recipients know who you are what you do and how to connect with you so many times like an email goes out i go well what okay yeah it's a really cool email but well, what is what are you trying to do what are you what are you trying to what are you asking this prospect to do? Well, I don't know. I just want them to read my email. No, no. You got to ask them to do something. Put a button in there to go to your, your agency automator website and run a quote. Put a button in there to go to the page where they can, they can run a, uh, a lightning term quote and buy the insurance while you're sleeping or having dinner with the family. You need to put a call to action in there. We'll talk more about that in a second. Always add more than one call to action. So, some people want to be called. Some people want to go to your website. Some people want to watch your video. So you need to have more than one call to action. 
because people respond in different ways. You may be surprised that if you only put a phone number in there, well, I'm not getting any calls. Put a website in there, well, maybe I get some web traffic. Put a video in, in there, or a link to a video. Okay, well, maybe somebody, go, somebody wants to go watch a video. You, you cannot kind of pre-guess what that person is interested in or how they may want to interact with you. You have to load it. Load it up with calls to action. Make it visually interesting. Do not just send an email. A lot of people say, oh, I'm gonna send an email with just text alone. So, you know, because my friend told me that that works best. Baloney. I, I don't look at emails. In fact, most of the malicious emails that I get are text only and that have some link in them. I go, I just stay away from those. The more professional your email looks, the more interesting it's gonna be and the more action it's gonna get. Set the table. Um, but this is a this is something that we, actually I, I just threw in there to help you understand on this mobile ready issue. There is a way, and I'll show you in a second. You can go in there and set that email up so that it is 100% mobile ready. You're setting the table uh, height and width to 100%. I'll show you a little diagram, and I'm going to be training on this more uh, aggressively in in our email or in our uh, live demos each week as well. Personalize your Kevin, messages a lot. Kev, yeah. we have about a, a minute or two left, just a heads up. Okay, so personalize your message. We'll talk about that on, we'll talk about a lot of this stuff in the um, on the live demos. So just uh, stick with those live demos and we're gonna, we're gonna be touching on a lot more of this stuff going forward. Building your email, I'm just gonna zip through this. There is a, there's a method here to build your email. And, and uh, Bill, maybe you want to make this uh, PowerPoint available to everybody that's, that's on the call, so they can yep, kind no of walk through this themselves, and they can we call us and, and ask any questions. But there is a, a way that you need to stack your email to make sure that you've got all of the bullet points covered, to make sure that that you're optimizing, you know, the the email design. And then you have all these different call to action opportunities that, that we talked about. These are the kind of things that you need to load into your marketing plan. You know, there needs to be a way for those. Certainly, if you send an email to someone, they can reply to you. They can visit your website. If you have a web, if you're using the agency automator website, they can go and fill out a capture form. They can network with you on LinkedIn, Facebook, Twitter, because you make those accounts available inside your email. They can pick up the phone and call you. Make sure your phone number's in there. If you're using a SureWorks, then they're going to click on that ad, and then that's going to hit the, the traffic part of it which hopefully you know, turns into a lead on some lead capture form on your website as well. So just to wrap up, we have the live demo trainings that I was talking about. Monday is SureWorks, Tuesday is the website builder, Wednesday is the CRM, Thursday is prospecting and agent recruiting. You go to Levinson & Associates to, to find all that information. If you're not contracted, go there, get contracted. Uh, the, Le the Levinson marketing people are second to none. They'll give you all the all the information you need to sign up for the program, and then uh, and get you plugged into the training. So, sorry I went long, Bill, but I was I was on my pulpit. No, that was perfect. We have a lot of information to cover in a short time, but that was great. Um, so just real quick, those, those live weekly demo trainings are so important. There's no more excuse to to not get started here and not jump in you know we get so many calls from agents that say you know i don't know where to begin or this is too confusing that's exactly why we put together these agent trainings every single monday tuesday wednesday thursday kevin hosts them we actually have an open line so you can jump in ask questions uh get your assistant or your admin person on the call with you so everybody's comfortable. Or if you want to just set up your autopilot with Kevin, you can do that as well. Then you don't have to worry about any of the weekly agent training. So totally up to you. Okay, the Levinson Expo, Kevin will be there live. We're going to present and go over all of the latest updates. Even by then, we'll have even better updates, okay, where this is a, a constantly evolving platform, and, and we know that. We get it. Make sure you register now. It's May 10th 2019 our keynote is joe ross the best life insurance sales trainer in the world in my opinion i think everybody will agree after he's done presenting okay uh moving forward here the agent trainings we just went over so just mark your calendar monday tuesday wednesday thursday all at 2 p.m 
Eastern. The new Mortgage Protection Updated Lead Program is relaunching on January 17th next week, 2 p.m. Eastern time. And then on January 24th, we have the industry's top long-term care and living benefit riders. The new way to sell life insurance with living benefits. That's going to be a great call on the 24th at 2 p.m. on the bottom of your screen. Okay, the last slide here. Uh, you know, I, I like to end these on a positive note. Uh, I know it's a little late here and I apologize. I think we're three minutes over. Um, but it's so important that, you know, we all get it and put our right foot forward, you know, and, and make it happen. Make this the year that you're going to get comfortable with some of this technology. And, you know, when you're thinking about these e-blasts or sending out a marketing piece or updating your website, I always look at it like reverse engineering, okay? Always look at the goal and then and then go backwards from the goal. And what what I like to do is pretend that you're the prospect, okay? In my case, I pretend I'm the agent and I say, "Okay, Bill, what would I want to see if I was the agent? What would I click on if I was the agent. Think about it the same way, but per, put your prospect hat on, okay? And that's the way that I cater and, and, and create and put a lot of these marketing pieces together is by the reverse engineering. I, I, I love that. Okay, we're going to end with our positive quotes, okay? And I think it's so important because I don't care how many degrees that you have or if you're a CLU or CHFC, I feel like if we're all putting our foot on the gas and we're consistent and persistent and we have the desire in the heart to grow and be successful, that there's no limit, especially with the internet and, and social media these days, okay? And, and the proof is in the pudding. Yesterday, I spoke about... 35% of all billionaires do not have a college degree, okay? What does that tell you? Okay, and by the way, that number has increased over the years. So what is that? That tells us all that we can become whatever it is that we put our heart and mind into. I love this quote. We just picked this out for today's presentation. Six months of focus and hard work can put you five years ahead in life. Don't underestimate the power of consistency in desire. With that said, have a great rest of the week, a good weekend, and great selling. Take care.